good news. I figured out what to do with all the money I save recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way future generations can learn from you how not to have your unfortunate bone structure. Perfect. The door is malfunctioning. Oh. Somebody's going to have to repair that too. No, don't get up. I'll be right back. Don't touch anything. Yes, the return of... Hey, hey, up here. I found some bird eggs up here. Just dropped into the door mechanism. Shut it right down. I... Ah! Bird! 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 Dummy. Okay, that's probably the bird in it that laid the eggs. Livid. Okay, look, the point is, we're going to break out of here. All right, very soon, I promise, I promise. I just have to figure out how to break us out of here. Here she comes. Keep te just keep testing. Remember, you never saw me. Never saw me. I saw someone, Glados. with the door mainframe. Let's just say he won't be well living anymore. Anyway, back to testing. I figured you'd say something like that, Glados. Glados, let's just kind of portal ourselves onto here. Oof. <laughs> Alright, so what am I trying to get up to? Excuse me. Or, I guess... Over to? No, that works. Um, something like that. One of these little veelies. I say that a lot now, huh? I'm becoming an old person. Yeesh. Oh, no, that... Is that the first death? Perhaps? And here I thought I was gonna go deathless the entire time since it's an easy game. Baby game for babies! That's right. Okay, so that's actually, uh, let's actually try something different. <laughs> I'm not an insane person in the membrane. Anyway, uh, that's not going to work. Oh, I'm just an idiot. Okay. Now that I have to, uh, now that I have the, the cube, it doesn't have to be something on this wall. It can be on this wall. Excuse me. And I fell. Now that's an accidental death. Something that I really could have gone without. But hey. Crapperture. Crapperture. I thought there was an A after the... It doesn't matter. Anyway. Crapshoot. Caution. I watched Deadpool again yesterday with my dad. Because he watches stuff too sometimes come on okay hoo 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 I thought I was gonna die there if only because I probably was excuse me well done. in fact you did so well I'm going to note this on your file in the commendation section oh there's lots of room here wow well. <laughs> oh my gosh uh, it's amazing how great this game is. I kind of hope it's short, but I also hope that it's not short. This so next test involves turrets. You remember them, right? Yeah. They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh wait, that's you in five seconds. Good luck. Oh crap. Are you? 
Okay, never mind. I hate these things. Okay. Oof. I really don't want to deal with these things, man. I didn't know I could do that. Whoa. Can I pick these up now? I can pick this boy up. Uh, have fun. I don't like this. I really don't like this. They have such a creepy voice. I don't like this. Hmm. not very nice. I figured it out guys, I just gotta drop stuff on him. Well, wow, that's nice. Alright, so if I open up a hole in the ceiling and drop another one on him. Go to one stone, my friend. Hey, that's nice. Good to know that I still have my good old friends, the the freaking turrets. Do I want to go down here? I don't know if I really do. Okay, I wasn't able to jump there, but hey. Uh. Oof. What does that mean? What is? Why is there even a loading screen here? Oh well. It's Cinco de Mayo. Well, you're probably seeing this on the. In a constant testing cycle, I simulate daylight at all hours and add adrenal vapor to your oxygen supply. So you may be confused about the passage of time. The point is, yesterday was your birthday. I thought you'd want to know. Thank you. I don't care.
Ow. You know how I'm going to live forever. You're going to be dead in 60 years. Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Well, more of a belated birthday medical procedure. Mm. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. I don't I don't know if I would like that, really. I think I'll just keep to myself and and die. I kinda wanna die eventually. Eventually. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. You look That's stupid. Not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people it looks fine. Ah uh, scientist has noted just that a moment. it looks stupid. Oh. Well, That'll be something I actually have to edit out. Well, what does a neckbearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... Oh, wait. It's a she. Still, what does she know? Oh, wait. It says she has a medical degree. In fashion. From France. Yes, Is anyone there? Gosh, I hate these things. Gosh, I hate these things. Man. Like, say what you will. This game is creepy. What am I really supposed to do here? I guess that <laughs> wasn't too difficult. Okay. Thank you. 
I'm going through the list of test subjects in cryogenic storage. Oh, really? I to find two with your last name. Oh. A man and a woman. Oh. So that's interesting. It's hey. a small world. Wow. Almost like they're related to me or something. It's a small world after all. I really need to talk more. Oh yeah, so I had track practice. Um, I have a surprise waiting for you after really? the next test. Really? would spoil the surprise. Yep. So I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. Activated. Target lost. Goodbye. I take a guess and say they're probably not my parents. Oh, that's good. I thought I was gonna have to like actually deal with these boys. Uh, shouldn't that be hitting that? I see the problem. Okay. So I need to yoink the... Wait a minute. That's a wall. Great. Okay. Feels really good, I gotta say. Anyway, um. Oh, yeah, that's what I, I'm sorry, I've been thinking about these too much. Hmm. I'm, I'm glad you remember it. it was my birthday, Gladys. Yeah. But, so I was in track practice, you know. So I get dressed out and I go out to the field because we were at the field for the entire week, basically. And no one comes out, so I'm like, oh, well, I guess we're not having... This was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. Well... It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. Okay, then. Okay, then. So... That's just gonna kinda um That activates the lift, so... Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I bet you think I forgot about your surprise. Okay, anyway. In fact, we're headed to a surprise right now. After all these years, I'm so, really choked up just thinking about it. Yeah, me too. Anyway, so in track practice, so I go out and there's no one there, so I think, oh, I guess we're not having track practice today. 
because it's like it's like Thursday and we're nearing the end of the school year you know so I go back and I oh cool oh, it's a new chapter so anyway I go back crap I'm gonna have to end the episode so let's just end it up on a funny note so I go back to the locker room and there's literally no one in there They're like the lights are off there's no one in there so I walk around try and look for him like they're they're not even outside the entire class no one's outside so I, I'm like, okay, I guess we're just hanging out in one of the coaches' rooms. So I visit both of the coaches' rooms. Nobody's there. And I'm like, well, dang. So then I go to the counselor's office, and I'm like, hey, man, like, where am I supposed to be? And they're just like, well, we don't know. And I'm like, well, dang. So then I go to, I have to go to attendance and be just like, hey, uh, I, I, went, I was in the wrong place, I guess. And, but I was here, so I wasn't tardy. So, yeah, I didn't get a tardy. Which is good. And then I saw some track people, and they apparently they went to uh, they went to some other school to watch one of our guys runs, run. And hey, that was cool. But I wasn't there, so yeah. Anyway, bye.